What's going on YouTube today? I got a fun one for you. So make sure you grab yourself a bottle and a tin and I'm going to show you five fun little show pours. Now let's get started. All right, first things first, our bottle is going to have about two ounces of liquid in there, all right? The less alcohol in the bottle, the less chance of spilling, all right? So when you're practicing, I want you to grab yourself a plastic bottle or an empty bottle. Now these show pours are not overly difficult. They will take some time to practice, so make sure you're putting in that time. Be patient and be consistent. You will get it, all right? So you don't want to use these pours in the middle of a busy bar, okay? I mean, you can depending on the flow of the bar, but try not to do it. And again, you can only do it when there's about two ounces of liquid in that bottle. So if you get to the point where you've got a bottle that's really low and you've got some free time, give it a go. If you don't have the time to do it, don't worry about it. Speed always comes first, okay? Now, although you can use these pours behind the bar, these pours look great for social media videos, presentations, competitions, and shows, okay? So this is a great way to really stand out, impress your guests, impress the people that are watching you to make yourself look like an absolute bar pro, eh? Now, if you do like these pours, feel free to give me a like, comment, hit the subscribe button. If you want to learn more, go to my website, www.cdbartending.com. Check out my masterclass. I've got 12 chapters that will turn you into an absolute bar star. And guess what? It's not overly hard to learn, eh? You put a little bit of practice in, you will get it, you will master it, you will use it, and you'll make that money, eh? Just let me know how much money you're making and about all those phone numbers you're getting, eh? All right, I know, I know, enough yapping and let's get started. You're dying to flip some bottles and here is our first pour that I'm going to show you. All right, so I got my bottle on my right, I got my tin on my left, okay? All I'm going to do is a regular swipe through, but I'm going to make it look a little bit cooler by adding a rotation, okay? I'm just throwing it over my hand like this. From here, I'm going into a one rotation and into a pour. Now what I'm doing here is I'm, my bottle's upward like so. I'm gonna throw, rotate my hand, and catch the bottle so it's facing down. I'll show you again. One, two. One, two. And then we're gonna go right into a pour. Now once we're at that pour, we're gonna cut to the right, we're gonna swing to the left, and we're gonna follow through with another rotation with the liquid inside, and we're gonna add that to our glass. So we're going swipe through, one rotation pour, cut to the right, swing to the left, throw the rotation, and then add that to our glass. And now I'm going to show you this one with a little bit of speed. We're going to swipe through, pour, cut, flip, and add to our glass. All right, our second pour looks like this. All right, so this one's going to take a little bit of hand-eye coordination, okay? So we're going to start off with my right hand in a reverse grip, tin in my left, and we're going to do a reverse swipe through. So instead of coming above, we're going to come underneath. We're going to throw the tin in the air and pull your arm through like so. All right, but to make it look a little bit cooler, we're going to add a rotation with the tin. And the tin is going to be parallel to our chest, so the rotation will look like this. So we're going to swing across like so. We're going to follow through around the back, releasing, going into a one rotation and pouring into a grip like so. I'll show you again. One behind the back, pour, and then when we cut, we're just doing a tin flip. The tin flip makes you a lot of cash. So get good at it, eh? So once you're comfortable with doing this and going around the back, we're gonna add a little flip. So the flip looks like this. Now a good way to practice this one is to go one at a time. So we're gonna go swipe through with the rotation catch, flip outward like so, follow through with around the back to a pour. I'll show you again. We're gonna go one, two, three into a pour. And then when you get quicker at it, it looks like this. So now that we've got a glass bottle, it should look like this. Ba, ba, ba. All right, our third pour looks like that. All right, you guessed it. This one's a little bit on the easier side. We're gonna do a rotation with the tin and a flip at the same time, and it looks like this. All right, you wanna make sure that the ball is a little bit higher so you don't uh, connect in the, middle of the, uh, in the middle of the throw, just like so. All right, once you're comfortable like this, when you cut, do a flip, do whatever you want with the tin after. You don't always have to do this tin flip. It's just easy to do and it looks cool and your guests will absolutely love it. They'll always be like, how come you didn't spill? Every single time, so get used to it. So it's a flip, flip, pour, cut, and another flip, and then add. 
So when you're making a drink, you grab your glass, you add your ice, you grab your tin, your bottle, double flip, pour, cut, flip, and then add that to your glass. All right, our fourth pour looks like this. So all we're going to do is that crossbody throw just like so, okay? We're throwing, rotating the hand, grabbing the neck. We're going to go around our head and add an axe throw just like so and pouring into the tin. Now, to make it look a little bit more fancy, you got to practice your hand spins, okay? So we're going to do this at the same time, go around the head, flip, and into a pour. I'll show you again. Spin and flip around the head and pour, all right? And with a little speed, looks like this. So now that we got our glass bottle ready, we're going to go one, around, and flip, cut, and into the glass. All right, our fifth pour is a cool one. It looks like this. All right, so I have the tin in my left hand, my bottle in my right hand. All I'm doing is I'm going to throw the tin with a one rotation to my right hand, just like so, okay? Nice and easy, just like so. All right, now my right hand has the bottle like this. What we're going to do is we're going to throw it inward, an invert toss, one rotation, and catch it into a pour with your left hand, just like this. So what we're going to do is we're going to put it together, tin first, and then follow with the tin. So we're creating a little bit of a circle motion. One, two. Pour. All right, I'll show you again. One, two, pour. All right, now we got our glass bottle. We're going to go one, two, into a pour, cut, and then if you want to do a tin flip, you're more than welcome to, eh? And there you have it, guys. There's five easy pours that you can use on stage or for social media or whatever you need to use it for to grab your guest's attention and to look like an absolute bar star, right? So guys, let me know what you want to see in the comments below. If you want to see more cocktail videos, more flair videos, let me know. I can do that absolutely. Maybe you want to see some behind the scene videos of my event company. Take a look at some of the events that we do. We're having a lot of fun this year. We've got some delicious recipes. We've got some amazing mobile bars that I can't wait to show you. So if you want to see something like that, let me know. Now, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell thing down there and get notified when my content is up. Check me out on Instagram, TikTok, all the above. Keep flipping these bottles and tins. Have fun, make that money, and I'll see you guys soon. Hey, cheers. Huh.